this girl is she's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She looks familiar. I can't place her though. A working girl? A working girl? I don't I mean, I am a working Oh. The woodsman. He attacked her, I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just... give me a second. It's just... terrible. So... tell me what happened. Every detail. I wish there was more to tell. I left the office, walked past the security desk. Luckily, he was asleep. Grimble. Yeah. Then I opened the door and... I found her. Like this. I came to get you right away. And that's all? That's it. Sorry. Big P, did one of... us... do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Recognize it. Neither do I. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with magic attached to it. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here, she was deliberately placed. For us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Ugh, I'm, I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. Um, what... what do you want to do next? Nothing much else to do. We should... move her. Before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? How did this happen? Why her? It's just so... awful. Someone brought her in from the outside. That makes sense. There's no signs of a struggle. But how do you know? I need more to go on. Let's head to the business office. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I know you don't like him, but he's our boss. This is part of the job. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <laughs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering.
Ukraine's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. What, are you blind? Why, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I know. I'm taking cuts. Is that supposed to be funny? You see anyone here laughing, sheriff? Fucker. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow! The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep! The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria! Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster! It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, is that how you see things? Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. Yeah, her pimp. Her... was she a... Yeah, she was worried about a money situation. Well, this is just wonderful. Not only is a fable killed, but it was a fable hooker to boot. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow! Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't oh, bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. Who gets a massage this early? Crane. It doesn't really matter the time of day. A mere scent of stress and he's out the door. Is... is he gone? 